sovereign citizen do? That means, guys, you are a sovereign citizen from Mexico. I know all about the gold bridge and how fraudulent it is. They hit me with a really strong dose of OC spray. I want to speak to you, Jess Soldier, now! I know the laws, buddy, and I'm waiting for you to do something wrong so I can sue you in the pocket. I pay for that uniform, I pay for that car, I'm the taxpayer, right? Hi folks, before we get started, let me welcome Liz Shaw as my newest channel member. If you'd like to be a channel member, the join link is in the description box. Now let's get down to business. I'm happy to report that SC Desert Fox was arrested again. If you don't remember her, here's a clip from an earlier video of mine where her and her idiot son get arrested. Uh -huh. Hey! Get this on my camera! Get this on my camera! Get my camera! Get my camera! Just my walking stick! Are you gonna resist? No, I'm not resisting. I need this. Casey! Casey, get that! I need that so I can get home. Get out of Get out of Get on camera! Call my lawyer! No, I ain't! I can't resist! You're a fucking liar! No, I didn't! Yo, I got on camera, dumb fuck! As you can see, she's a sweet lady. Before I get into why she was arrested this time, let's watch her and her idiot son call the FBI to defend fellow idiot Blind Justice. First and last name, please. Sheila. S H I. Excuse me. S H E L I A. That's right, people. She doesn't know how to spell her own name. But it gets even worse. Her son slash brother doesn't know how to spell her last name. B as in boy. I as in ice cream. Well, no, I'm, I'm not a, hey son, come do your army, because okay. I can't do that. Alright, I don't do that army stuff. B as in Bravo, E as in Echo, R as in Romeo, I as in Igloo, S as in Sierra, T, T as in Tango, A. A as in Alpha, I as in Igloo, and N as in November. Jethro here does not only not know how to spell his mom's last name, but he claims to be a veteran, yet he doesn't know what every veteran in the world knows. In the phonetic alphabet, the letter I is India, not Igloo. Try harder, Jethro. Okay, okay ma'am, do you have a problem with, with how a county jail handled a prisoner? Oh, no, 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 no. This is a federal, oh, sir. This is a, let me speak to your supervisor. Let me speak to your supervisor. What is your name, sir? What is your name? My offer ID is 9616. Nine what? 9-6? 9616. If you have a problem with how a local county jail... Sir, you're not listening. A local county jail puts a blind veteran... Can you hush for one minute, please? Can you hush for one minute, please? See, you can listen. Give me that goddamn phone. Again, as you can see, these are super nice, well-grounded people. Well, Granny went to the hospital and did a dumb and got arrested yet again. There's no video of the arrest, but we can hear Jethro try to use words to tell us what happened. She got arrested for disorderly conduct and supposedly assault and battery in the third degree when they're the ones who slammed her into a bench, causing her leg to come up and kick somebody. It happened around like nine something last night at the uh, McLeod Medical Center. I couldn't help myself, so I decided to troll him a little during his live stream. He didn't seem to get it. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. I don't know about you, but... Filming with a potato. Oh, I don't understand that. It means you can't technology, Jethro. Then this happened. Which is weird because how can I owe you something if I've never heard of you? But if you come to my channel Friday night at 6 p.m., you can hear me debate this lady. She's some sort of First Amendment auditor fangirl, and it should be a fun talk because she's, how should I say this, unique. Now let's listen to Jethro flex his physics muscles. Hey, isn't that the cat that they put in a box and they said they put poison in there and 
is the cat live or dead? But you can't check the box to be 100% sure. Is, is that where that cat phrase comes from? I have to admit, I was impressed that he even had that childlike understanding of my name. Well done, Jethro. Hey, cat, is, is, is that that uh, conundrum question about the cat being a box? Is it lives, uh, alive or dead? Is that where you got your name from? <laughs> Don't worry, Scrub. Now there are plenty of tards out there living really kick-ass lives. My first wife was tarded. She's a pilot now. Okay, enough picking on Jethro. Now let's pick on his mom slash sister. She got out of jail and immediately started saying stupid online. Uh, when I got in there, one of the officers recognized me and he asked me, I said, yeah, I'm the Swamp Fox. He says, yeah, you her. Getting arrested so often that the jail guards recognize you isn't something to be proud of. But maybe that's just me. I have a knee brace that I wear and it's got metal pieces in it. And when I get arrested, they're supposed to put me in the back uh, by myself, which has a bed. <laughs> Jesus, lady, how many times have you been arrested that you even know where in the jail they're supposed to put you? Do they have a cell set aside just because they're reasonably sure that Grandma Stupid will be arriving soon? I was trespassed. I will tell you that. I was in the progress of going up there to... In the progress of going up there? I think you meant process. I've been to South Carolina. Their schools are not this bad. And my sister, my baby sister, Connie, no, he's not my son. She's not my son's wife. Why did you feel the need to throw that in there? Are there rumors? Are you hearing whispers when you shop at the local Piggly Wiggly? Yes, I had a post bond, 1,092, I think, which is $100. Um, I have my favorite bondsman on side just in case I have to bond out. and He's been great with me. Your favorite bail bondsman? You have a favorite bail bondsman. Seriously, this just keeps getting more and more embarrassing. You know, a lot of people don't forget this mouth. That's what they say at the truck stop. But anyhow, I'm going to talk to them about getting that trespass taken down because my father is still in the hospital. I may have forgotten to mention that she got arrested while visiting her father in the hospital because she wouldn't wear a mask. What could possibly be more ghetto than that? Well, that's all the dumb out of these two, but undoubtedly there'll be more. They can't get out of their own way. And next time, I'll be there to bring it to you again. If you like this video and you want to see more stupid in the future, please like and subscribe.